Hi, this is Katie. It is nine o'clock on Tuesday, Tuesday morning, and it's very echoey in my apartment because I just finished, well, basically finished moving everything into my car. So I wanted to show you guys my empty apartment quick, and then I'm leaving. I'm heading on the road, so hold on. Empty kitchen. Empty living room. Empty bedroom. Empty closet. Empty bathroom. Gotta throw that out. And then just a couple things on my desk that I'm bringing with me. And that's it. Oh, and now, since I already moved out, I can show you the view from my balcony. Isn't this gorgeous? Okay, I'm gonna bring the last couple things in the car and then I'm hitting the road. Can you guys guess where I'm going? You guys probably know where I'm going, but I will let you know when I get there. But uh, yeah, I'm getting on the road, I'm getting on the road. I can't speak. When you're near me, all I feel is something way bigger than me. You take the ropes and I'll take advantage. You've never been loved and I'm a romantic. I know you've been hurt, but you could put faith into me. Cause I promise that I'll love you slow. I'll never be the first to. Something different You are the piece I've been missing All my life Do you feel the same? I can't sleep Thinking about you All I feel Is you make it harder to breathe You take the ropes And I'll take advantage You've never been loved And I'm a romantic I know you've been hurt, but you could put faith into me Cause I promise that I love you slow I'll never be the first to go You make me feel something different You are the piece I've been missing all my life Do you feel the same? We've both been through the pain Said things never change I know you've been hurt But you could put faith into me Cause I promise that I'll love you slow I'll never be the first to go You make me feel something different You love the piece I've been missing all my life later and I wanted to give you an update on what is going on in my life. So as a lot of you guys know, I lived in my car and traveled around the country for several years and in November I decided to get an apartment in Charleston to check out apartment life, see how that is, be close to my dad and my lease was up a couple days ago. Uh, well actually if you guys have been really watching me you know that my lease was up a couple months ago and I extended it uh, because of all of the issues going on and then my lease was up again a couple days ago and I did not renew or extend my lease. I thought it was just time for me to leave and I will be talking about my like experience in an apartment in a separate video but it just was time for me to leave and so the last few videos you saw me packing up my car and as much as I would have liked going back on the road um, because I love traveling I like living out of my car I think it's so fun I like all the adventure aspect of being on the road just with everything going on right now in America in the world really I just did not feel safe I know some people can travel right now and feel safe with that or they can 
and live in their car and do it in a safe way but just for me the way that I like to do it um, I like to you know like be really social and go to restaurants and go to cities and go to national parks and be around people and stuff and so I couldn't really do any of the things that I enjoy doing while I'm traveling I couldn't really do any of that right now and so it just did not seem like the best option for me to get back on the road full time to go back to living in my car it just did not feel super safe to me it did not feel like the best option and so when I was thinking about my other options and what would be a really good idea for me I decided to text my best friend David you guys know David he's been in a couple of my videos I talk about him all the time and I've lived with David quite a few times before and so I texted him a couple weeks ago and asked if I could stay with him for a few months and he said yes and I'm so grateful because I feel safe with him um, he has a two-bedroom apartment and so I'm renting out this room for from him and I'm in you guys know I think you saw in the footage I am in Nashville Nashville is like my favorite city I'm here all the time and so I'm really really grateful um, that David had this room that I could rent from him and that I'm gonna be around him and his cat monkey who's such a cute cat but yeah so this just seemed like the best option for me and I'm really really glad that I even had this option to be in this apartment with David uh, somewhere that I feel safe uh, and in one of my favorite places in the country and so because I know quite a few of you were a little bit nervous about me getting back on the road and just a lot of you guys were curious about where I was going and so I definitely wanted to make this video to let you guys know that yes my lease was up I did not decide to renew it I did not decide to stay in South Carolina and uh, I just wanted somewhere safe to go for the next few months until we just see what happens do I want to get back on the road at some point absolutely but I'm going to do it when I believe for me that it's super safe and that I feel really comfortable doing so which I just don't know when that's gonna be so I'm going to be here for a couple months and then I guess I'll reevaluate. But yeah, so I'll have videos in the apartment. I'll probably try to get David to be in some of them. Um, and then just around Nashville, around town, and you know, still vlogging and stuff, but then definitely updates on what I thought about apartment life, what I thought about Charleston, um, apartment life versus car life, all that kind of stuff, I'm still going to have in my videos. But yeah, I just wanted to give you that little update. I am safe, and I'm going to be in Nashville for the time being, staying at David's house. And so anyway, yeah, I guess it's gonna be it for this little update. Thank you guys so much for watching watching and um, please make sure that you're subscribed to my channel and Instagram if you would like and I guess that's gonna be it thanks again for watching and I hope that you guys have a wonderful day I love you Jesus loves you and I'll talk to you later bye